Trigger warning. Stop here. If you get easily butthurt, you might want to go watch that tw MTV 2017 New Year's Resolution bullshit. Anyways, the glowing skull here, and welcome to a different type of video. This is usually, I usually do gaming stuff on the channel, but today we're talking about transgenders and if they should be allowed to use opposite gender public bathrooms. If you ask me, there are both pros and cons to having transgender people be able to use whatever bathroom they feel comfortable in. I just think that the cons greatly outweigh the pros. Our pros being equality for the transgendered individuals and having them be comfortable in their public restrooms. You might be wondering about the very, very severe cons here, the rape and molestation. And the reason I believe this would happen is if somebody who lies about being a transgendered but is actually a pedophile can now get into their target's bathroom. I can understand that the same thing can happen without the transgendered mixed bathrooms with just homosexual pedophiles who want the little boys, but there are more people who are straight and pedophiles than there are who are homosexual and pedophiles. The statistics on that being an average of two to one, two female children for every one male child that gets molested. So if pedophiliacs can get into their target's restrooms, a spot where you can isolate a kid in a stall, the actions might double. The same general concept is going to be with the lawsuits and the accus sexual harassment accusations and sexual assault. What's going to happen is these pervert straight men are going to walk in there and start watching these women while they go to the bathroom they're gonna start beating their meat in the stall next to them they're, it's gonna be it's gonna be disgusting and it's all gonna be thanks to the fact that it's very easy to lie about being transgendered it doesn't take much to say I identify as the opposite sex so instead of making the transgenders equal you're instead allowing pedophiles and perverts to go into the bathrooms of the opposite sex just for sexual reasons. Now, a good way to fix this, there isn't one. You can't just tell somebody that they're not allowed to go into the opposite gender's bathroom because they're not transgender enough, if they don't look, sound, or act transgender. That would be discriminating and stereotyping. And in a politically correct world, you can't do that. It's not right. It's not okay. You can't single people out. And that's basically the only way that we could do this. And you, you, you can't. So, it wouldn't work. Even, even for quality reasons. You could try, but there would always be problems with it. I apologize, transgender people, but... If we want to keep people from being molested and raped, then you can't go into the opposite gender's bathroom. I understand if you identify as a male or female or of neither and you still want to go into the opposite gender's bathroom, but you can't. It, it wouldn't just be you going in. It would be the other people who don't want to be accepted but instead want to be rapists and pedophiles and sexual harassers and these other things that nobody wants to happen. And with that said, I've got one last thing to add. If you're a feminist and you don't want women to be raped and assaulted and harassed sexually, then don't support this, don't let this happen. I'm not saying that it would be bad for the transgendered people to be equal and be able to do what they feel they should be able to do but it would just be bad for all the other reasons anyways likes comments subscribe share get me out there you guys if you love the video exist a little <laughs> see you guys